first and 10 ball on the 45. Triple option offense lined up once again. Man in motion, the snap, and it looks like he's going to keep it himself. Luptak is breaking up the right side. Luptak cuts back inside. He's going to have a missed tackle there for Waynesburg, and the Tanko wasn't able to bring him down, but Luptak was stopped. But he was able to move the chains as they're back in formation once again. They're just going to keep driving this one straight down Waynesburg's throat as the snap, and it looks like Luptak eyeing up a man. He fires this pass downfield. They're past the 30-yard line. That pass, that was the Pete. Second in seven for Geneva. Luptek now takes his place. He now runs and he pitches it eventually. And getting that first down is Pete. Luptek once again under center in the formation we've seen all game for Geneva. Now he gives it to Lippiotti up the middle. He gets into Waynesburg territory and keeps pushing his way forward. Progress, progress is going to give him enough for the first down. But great running there by Lippiotti is coming into this game. He had 57 attempts for 244 rushing yards and two touchdowns. The freshman out of Salem, Ohio. Lubtec now, he keeps, now he pitches it. And Pete has a lot of room down that sideline, and he's going to take it all the way for a touchdown. But hold the phone, everyone. We have a flag near the line of scrimmage. That one was thrown pretty early on into this play. Not quite sure. Didn't get a look at what it was. But we're going to have to see what happens here. Offsides on Waynesburg. Obviously, the penalties decline. Four wideouts on the field for Waynesburg. Reigns takes the snap. Blitz coming. And he is going to be sacked on the play by Geneva. Hayden Sc Scalarbaum was in there on the sack, along with Levi Railing, bringing up a fourth and long as Rangers had no time to throw at all. As Geneva will call its last timeout, Geneva will hurry second and eight. Now Luptak back to throw. He throws at about midfield, and that is complete to Mont Monte Leone for the first down. Well, thus far. Second and ten, Luptak. He's back to throw. Getting pressure, and that is complete at the Waynesburg 34 to Monte Leone. Once again, he gets out of bounds. A second and seven at the Waynesburg 45 yard line. Now Luptak. As now he waits for singles, he sends Pete back over to where he was. Now Luptek, he's back to throw. He throws a slant over the middle. That's caught for a first down. In more by Monte Leone. He makes a man miss. He's now inside the 35-yard line. Got brought down at the Waynesburg 34-yard line. Great moves there by Monte Leone at the 19-yard line. Now Luptek, he runs and he keeps it himself. He has a hole inside the 10 now. And he will be... A couple yards short of the first down, he was brought down. First and goal for Geneva at the four-yard line. Leptak under center. Now he's going to keep it himself. He has a hole, and he will find the end zone as he's able to waltz in for the easy four-yard rushing touchdown as Geneva is now one point away from tying up this ball game. Leptak, his fourth rushing touchdown of the season. It has it at its own 32 yard line, second and five. Luptek now. He tosses it once again. That is to Pete, and he has a hole. He makes a man miss. He has nothing but green grass cuts in the middle. 25, and he's brought down inside the Waynesburg 25 yard line by Luke Mangus. Second and long. Luptek now. Back to throw. He throws. Down the middle, and that is caught for the touchdown. That is Peyton Shell, his first touchdown reception of the season. And Geneva takes the lead 20 to 14. Just a simple drop back there by Lubtech. Great timing play on the slant route as Shell's able to beat his man and score the touchdown. That a lot on the line tonight for this Waynesburg team. Reigns drops back. Reigns. Fires it downfield. It's picked off. Geneva takes this one. And that's that's it. Waynesburg. Dakota Allen was able to read Reigns and picks him off. And 
Less than two minutes to go. Waynesburg looks like they're going to finish this season winless once again. Dakota Allen comes up when he's needed. You can see Reigns fires this one. Looks like he was looking for Brennan, but Dakota Allen was standing right in front of him. Just got to throw that one higher if you're going to get that to Brennan. And that's a tough way, tough pill to swallow for this Waynesburg offense, for this Waynesburg team. 